Russian oligarch from Ukraine with a passion for portraiture, putting rare Soviet paintings on display. 500 square meters of London's Somerset House, dedicated to 40 works by artist Viktor Popkov, pieces kept hidden for years behind the Iron Curtain. I think this exhibition gives you the opportunity to see Soviet art in a much more positive light. It has much more connection with this broader sense of humanity. Um, and Popkov has a lot to teach us about art. The exhibition is the initiative of Andrei Filatov, a 42-year-old ports magnate who hopes that cultural diplomacy can stem the damage done by sanctions. I really want to show the creative work of Russian people so that there is more of an understanding and love for Russia. This will improve understanding and relations between different people and countries. That is the meaning of this exhibition. So essentially art gives people a chance to understand each other better, especially at a time like this. I very much hope that there will be a better understanding of the Russian position because here there is a lack of knowledge, of information about what is happening in Ukraine. So I consider that those sanctions that were enforced are a big mistake. I am from Ukraine myself. I am a native of Ukraine. I understand very well what is happening there. Therefore, my outlook of the situation is that people in Europe and America don't understand what is happening in Ukraine well enough. With a $1 billion fortune and millions invested in art, Filatov has ambitions for a permanent collection in the British capital. This is my dream. I want to set up a museum in London so there's an opportunity to present our great Russian art. Walking around here in London, I discovered there's not one space and not one large collection of Russian art. Russian culture is not present here, yet hundreds of thousands of people from Russia live here. Russian children go to school here and they're losing their connection to their own culture. So a cultural infrastructure needs to be set up here. I want to realize this. Giving these scenes of Russia's Soviet past renewed life miles from Moscow. Nina Dos Santos, CNN, London.